Hello and welcome to the used aquaristic company in Germany. Today I made some uh, maintenance at these small tanks under me and around me. Normally I have to go on to the next customer, but I decide to spend 10 minutes with you to show you around what uh, we have here. Just a short overview and I hope you enjoy the video and so let's go down. I try. I'm back on the first floor. So this is the entrance of the company US Appressive and US Aquaristic. This tank is around 2000 liter and this 5000 liter. This is I think five years, two years old. This one is we, I set up a few weeks ago because we have to move some fish. Sorry for the reflection here, it's not easy. Uh, it's a 1945, 45, something else. We have some uh, nice back to nature sinking rocks inside and actually only few notropsis. I think they're a little bit shy, you see them here, yeah. And uh, yeah, I need this tank for some other fish before and so we decided to let it here. I think it's a good place for them. Let's try to feed them a little bit. Or maybe you see them. Really nice group of Snotropsis crosomus. Oh, no feed. It's too boring. So this is the first one. Let me go down. Just aquaristic. Uh, they made some special products to clean your aquarium sponges, towels, really nice, cool, 100% scratching free, made in Germany. So if you want to test it, or oh, this guy also tests it sometimes. <laughs> so anyway, this is the 2000 liter uh, African cichlid tank, mostly from Malawi, but we have also some other kind of uh, different fish inside. So it's, it's more a little bit community tank. You see the plant here, the, the roots are with, the, with the, the plants and with the roots inside the tank to uh, get a little bit nitrate and phosphate out of the water. Whoops, sorry. And yeah, not more, much more to say. Okay, the filter system maybe. This is, this is a sump filter system. So I think maybe 800 liter sump filter and 2000 liter tank himself. Let's try to feed them a little bit. Sorry when it, the camera is today not so professional, but it's just by hand, not planned. So. I, I, like I told you, I think this is around four years old now, this tank. I just put some other kind of rocks inside, so it's very easy and simple and very important also. Maybe you have to, I want to show you. There's a permanent inflow inside. So this tank is running. See this here? There's some drops coming on the, uh, from this hose. And so we have a permanent inflow around 70, 80 liters per day. And so this is the, the water change every day or the permanent inflow. So. And this is the big one. Maybe you know this, it's around 5,000 liter. And before I describe this a little bit more, I go in the basement and show you the filter system. So I need to speak a little bit louder. You see it's a little bit noisy, or you hear, see. <laughs> you see this is a um, sand filter system normally for pools. And we, this is the main filter of the big 5,000 liter tank. It's coming also with a UV lamp and there's a heating system on this side. So everything in one, and the only thing what you need to do is every week to backwash the filter system. So that's also, it's, it's a closed filter. It's like a big canister filter. Uh, yeah, that's all. It's running really well, and uh, the tank is very clean with the sand filter. 
And here we have a really old tank. This is 22 years old tank. I have to rebuild this uh, from a customer because of uh, some private problems. And uh, we rebuilt this very old tank two weeks ago and we're having a really amazing group of trophies here inside coming with the tank. We're still searching some new home for this fish because uh, we try to build up um, a home for fish. You have to, which are too big, a rescue center for fish. We built up this year and this is one of the part. For this reason we make this because we're searching a new kind. We're searching a home for this really nice trophies. Um, I can't see them now so much, so maybe you see them better here. It's a really nice group of more boys. So if some find someone here in Germany hear me, we are still searching a group for this amazing 40 adult trophies more group. You can have them without the tank or with the tank. It's old, but it's cool, I think. It's a filter system here inside on the left side. I like it very much. So go up. So here I am again. And uh, above this tank, I can say, okay, this is around five meter long, 120 meter high. And this root, what you here see is uh, not an artificial, this is a real root, uh, wood or root, what else. Uh, is around, the weight is around 240 kilos. And I planted this tank around one and a half year ago, I think. And today I decide to making a kind of rescape in the summer. So I will remove all the plants here and I want to have some bigger root here and some also here. I want to have a little bit more interesting layout in this kind of tank. So it looks, it's more the shark tank now. <laughs> and the shark fin. So if you can want to see, is, the problem is the reflection of this tank is very extreme and I can show you this wood and all the plants is the similar like on the, on the other side. The uh, roots are inside the tank. This is also permanent inflow. Let me see. Permanent uh, water change. We're having the overflow on the left side and you have this ficus pumula here growing with the roots in the tank and also these ferns. There's no spraying necessary, no watering necessary and this is just for, yeah just they live on this kind of root. Oh, let me feed a little bit. They're having a lot of different uh, um, fish here inside. So this is also more a community tank, I would say. I try to find a play space with not so much reflection here, but it's near to impossible. We are having a uh, um, albino heckley, we are having um, Maurice, not Maurice, Mickey, Tichlasoma, a lot of tetras different, also from Africa, not only from South America. So it's a kind of um, community. I go a little bit back though, so, and the reflection is not so bad. Just only some ferns, some Anubias, and uh, I will move them all. I will replant it and rescape it uh, in the summer this year. Uh, summer, yes, that we're having a new look at this tank. Actually, it looks not so bad, but uh, my customer also want a little bit more fresh look. So let's see what we can do with them. Okay, so I think that's all. I hope it was not too boring. I go a little bit upstairs again to say goodbye. Zoopy. So you can see this is the entrance and you go upstairs and we're having these two tanks. You can relax as a customer or as employee. And we think also this area for relaxing. That's all. I hope you enjoyed this small video and uh, give me some comments if I should say more about this or repeat it or something else. And thank you very much. And uh, yeah, goodbye till next time.